I see your dirty face Hot behind your collar But it's done in vain Truth is hard to swallow So you pray to God To justify the way you live a lie Hey guys, it's Dante from CrossFit Tutorials. Today's video is going to be a cool video. I'm going to do a walkthrough of the YouTube channel page and how to edit it and customize it. Now, log into YouTube, go up to your name, click on it, go to my channel. Now, go to settings first. Okay, start off. URL is naturally the URL of your channel. The title is the title that goes right next to your channel icon on the top of your page, right here. Channel type is what you consider your videos to be. Um, you can be just a YouTuber, um, a director, musician, comedian, guru, or reporter. Um, I'm a guru because I, you know, am good at a certain topic. Make channel visible. This is a really cool feature I like that YouTube added uh, recently. Um, it basically is like an on and off switch for your channel being visible. Um, if you hit yes and save it, people can go to your channel like usual. Let's say you want to edit your background or edit your video, do something that you don't want people to see it. You hit no, hit save. Now when something goes to your channel, it'll say channel's unavailable. And then you can, you know, um, hit yes and save it again when you're ready to release your channel. And then channel tags. Um, this is basically how your channel's identified. It says type keywords um, to help people find your channel. So I'll also type in my name. Stuff like that. And then, it's find the boxes down here. It says, let others find my channel on YouTube if they have my email address. So, you can have it checked. Um, it's up to you. I usually like to uncheck it. Um, I don't know. It's my, my opinion. Um, let me save this first. Now, themes and colors. This is basically um, a whole new um, area. Um, you can customize what your channel looks like, and then your background image, you can make a background image, customize it. That's a whole another area, so I'll skip that right now. Now modules. This is how to basically say what's on your channel. Um, you can see here I have subscriptions, subscribers, recent activity, and um, other channels. Now other channels is a feature that recently added to everybody. Before it was just for partners, but now anyone can do it. So comments naturally is comments. Now other channels. If you check that box, hit save, you'll see a box pop up. You hit edit. Then you can go through here and you type a title. And you see you can type up the 16 destination channels. And all you do is type the name of the channel and just space hit space bar and type another one. So that's a really cool feature they have. Just hit save and the channel will pop up here. Subscriptions is, is um who you're subscribed to. Um, friends is who you're friends with. I usually get that off, but it's up to you. Recent activity um, is a cool feature. Now, many people don't know that in this box here, you can type message. Um, you can see out here, like the horn, it'll pop up like that. Now, that's basically like a YouTube Twitter. Um, you can type messages and it'll go out to all your subscribers, which is a cool feature. I like it a lot. I use it sometimes. And then um, groups, which what your group's part of. So let me see if I'm part of any groups. I don't think so, but I'm not sure exactly what that is. I guess what groups you're part of on YouTube as far as like um, the friends and stuff. I'm not sure it's a big deal, but um, I just keep that off. And then naturally subscribers is who you subscribe to you. Um, that's simple there. Now under recent activity, you can go to privacy and decide what people see when you do it. So I have the main things, my subscriber channel a video, upload a video. You can change that if you like it. Um, you know, it's totally up to you. And next is videos and playlists. This is pretty complicated now. Um, first, it says which content we like to display. This is basically what you want your people to see on your channel. Um, I have all mine selected. Your uploaded videos, your favorites and playlists. Um, you can check which ones you want to show or you can just hit Allow to show all, there will be an all button here, you can see them all on the right side. But I just like these three because it keeps them more organized. 
and then you can look at how you want to feature your layout. Um, grid view is kind of like just a grid of all your videos. Not really. I don't know. I like the uh, the player view better, but it's up to you. And then um, the feature content. That's exactly what um, goes on the side here when you click on your channel. So like if you hit my uploaded videos, when you click on your channel, your uploads will come up. If you want to choose your favorites, um, hit save. When you go on your channel, your favorites will pop up. And you can choose your playlist if you want. It's up to you. Now, feature video. That's when you decide what your feature video should be. Usually, you have it on use the most recent video. Or if you like a certain video you want to show or showcase more than another one, you can choose the video from all your videos here. But I just use my most recent. Now, another new feature of YouTube added that was just for partners, but now it's for everybody. It's autoplay, which I like to use. Um, basically, that does when you're told you can visit your channel, video will automatically play. So, I like that a lot. And finally, um, which playlist you like to display? Um, if you make a lot of them, they'll be all here. You can uncheck certain ones. So, when you go to your playlist down here, only certain ones show up. So, that's really it, guys. Um, and then, as far as editing, you can go edit your profile on your channel. There's tons of things here you can do. Your age, your style. Um, you can uncheck things you don't want to be shown. Your website, your description about me. So, you can have fun customizing that to your liking. Also, Let's see. You want to rearrange the things? You can these arrows here. You can move this over to the right side. Now it'll pop, pop over here. We'll move it back. Move this up. It's very customizable, which I like a lot. But I like it like this personally. So, if you guys have any questions, put them in the comments down below. And until next time, I'll see you guys later.